Welcome everybody to the Daily Presidential Address. I'm going to take apart the Tampa Bay Atlanta Falcons game happening this Thursday night. Before we get into that, I want to tell you all it is $2 Tuesday, $5 for my feature play, which happens to be an NFL total for this Sunday. Uh, it is a 4% play. I'm on a 25 and 10 run in these 4% NFL plays, and I have won my last two weeks of NFL for my clients. So make sure to take advantage of the $5 Tuesday play. Okay, let's get into this Tampa Bay Atlanta game. Absolutely massive game. Uh, this division is going to come down to one game. Uh, this there, it, there is a very likely chance that between New Orleans, Tampa Bay, and Atlanta, all three of them could be tied at the end. So these division games are crucial. Atlanta's offense just really can't get going. Yeah, they put up 26 points against a good Saints unit, but they got scores by both their defense and their special teams. This Fal The Falcons won this game without scoring a single touchdown on offense, and they needed a 58-yarder with two seconds left to take the W. The Falcons... They're a bottom half in the league team in yards gained, yards rushing, yard passing yards, and points scored. Defensively, their stat line is the same. As the cool kids say, their D is mid, and their num the numbers back that up. I came into the season with very high expectations on this team, and for the record, low expectations on the Bucks. I think I was wrong on both accounts. This Bucks team has beaten Philadelphia, the Lions in Detroit, and Washington, who is now 3-1 and one on the year. They are playing great offensively, and their D unit is finally coming together. Tampa Bay had six sacks against the Eagles, and if I'm the Falcons, that would worry me, as not only do they have major offensive line issues, but Captain Kirk is really struggling with the pressure right now. There's just no other way to bet this game than to take the points here. And frankly, I wouldn't be surprised if this was a 2020 game that goes into overtime. This is such a crucial game for both teams. I do lean on the under in this game, but I am worried about some big plays getting in the way. My bet on this game would be Tampa Bay plus one and a half with a lean to the under. Thank you.